I wanted to let you know that a few days ago I received a letter from the ITF that I had failed a drug test at the Australian Open. The former tennis world number one, Maria Sharapova, has revealed she failed a drug test at the Australian Open. I did fail the test and I take full responsibility for it. For the past 10 years, um, I have been given a medicine called Mildrenat by my doctor, by my family doctor. And a few days ago after I received the ITF letter, um, I found out that it also has another name of meldonium, which I did not know. It's very important for you to understand that for 10 years, this medicine was not on WADA's ban list, and I had been legally taking the medicine um, for the past 10 years. But on January 1st, the rules had changed, and meldonium became a prohibited substance, which I had not known. I made a huge mistake, and I, I've let my fans down. I've let the sport down that I've been playing since the age of four that I love so deeply. At 28 years old, the five times Grand Slam champion hasn't competed since she lost to Serena Williams in the quarterfinals of the Australian Open back in January, but says despite this, she wants to play again. I know that with this, I, I face consequences and I've, I don't want to end my career this way and I really hope that I will be given another chance to play this game.